Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing another tutorial using the Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette because a few of you asked for it. So we're going to start with our face like per usual. We're going to use the Maybelline Instant Age Ruan Primer. And yes, my face is still messed up from that Rimmel Prep and Prime or whatever it is. It is like horrific. It's burnt a hole in my face. So I'm going to go in with the Hourglass Foundation Stick and we're just going to pop that in a few sections of our face and then blend it out. I had really high expectations for this. This was my first time using it and I did not love it. So for a bit more coverage, I went in with the Fenty Beauty Foundation because this stuff is amazing. So I went over the top with this and it just like fixed me right up. With this sort of colorful eye look, I love to have a flawless face. So that's kind of what I went for. Then using my trusty Maybelline Instant Age Rewind underneath my eyes. So I'm just popping that in a triangle and blending that out with my Beauty Blender again. Then just going with my Australis Banana Powder. I love this stuff because it does a little bit of colour correcting, counteracts the purple underneath the eyes. Slapping on some Bourjois Healthy Balance just on the rest of the face because I am quite oily so this just eliminates any shine. To warm up the perimeter around the face I went in with the Chi Chi Bronzer on a stippling brush and just literally smothered my face in it. Then to add some cheekbones in, I went in with the NYX Blush and Contour Duo just to chisel out some face structure a little bit. For some cheek colour, I went in with the Colourpop Blush. I'm so confused whether these are cream or powder because they feel like cream but they go on like powder. And then for a highlight with my Laura Geller Trusty Gilded Honey. It is absolutely stunning as you can see. Then doing some benefit brows, I'm just going to quickly skip over this because I find it so boring watching myself do my eyebrows. Starting out with this shade here, I'm going to pop that on a fluffy brush and sweep that through our crease. It's going to be a bit of a transition colour. Oh my god, this colour here is one of my absolute favourites, so we're just kind of more directly putting that through the crease and then lightly blending it up, but not very high. Using Soft Ochre as a bit of a eyeshadow primer and just cancelling at any of those shades on our lid. We're going to take our main lid colour, this really lovely aqua green at the bottom and pop that all over our eyelids so it's almost like a really sloppy cut crease. Then we're going to take a deeper warm shade, so this brown tone here and pop that directly through our crease. So as I said before it's almost a cut crease but we are blending those two shades together quite well so it's not going to be a perfect cut at all. Then I'm just applying that first crease colour along the whole bottom lash line and then a little bit of that darker brown tone on the outer half to deepen it up. And then I did add a little bit of green directly through the lash line because we are going to be adding a green eyeliner in. Popping on the Glam by Manicare Adriana lashes, they're a little bit more dramatic than what I usually go for but I feel like this style of eye definitely needs a good pair of lashes. Then we're getting to the end of the eyes. We're going to do a bit of a winged eyeliner using my favourite eyeliner, the Rimmel Glam Eyes. Then using my favourite mascara, the Maybelline Falsies Push Up Angel to tie in my fake lashes with my real lashes and add a little bit to the bottom. For the lips, I went in with a liquid lipstick by Lime Crime. At first, I thought that it was a little bit too red for the eyes, so I did go over the top with one of the Kylie liquid lips, and I really liked them two together. So that's kind of the look I created. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll hopefully see you in my next video. Bye!